How does one replace Mohamed Salah? That's one question that nobody at Liverpool would want to talk about, let alone allowing such thoughts. But the prospect of losing the Egyptian, perhaps their greatest player in the history of the club, could be edging closer, with the Saudi Pro League likely to try price him away from the Premier League in the summer, or even as early as January. The winger may yet stay, but being on the bad side of 30 and having just two years left on his current Anfield deal, it would be wise for Liverpool to start preparing for his departure. The earlier, the better. No doubt it is a big hole to fill. The Egyptian has over 300 appearances, scored over 190 goals, and is approaching the 100 mark in assists for Liverpool. And since he signed for the club in 2017, he's yet to record an average below one goal in every two games in the Premier League. It won't just be his goals that Liverpool will need to replace, but also his underrated creativity. He is averaging an assist every three league games across his Liverpool career, even when he's having a bad season, like the 2020-21 for instance. Then there is one other thing that makes his so reliable, his exemplary fitness record, which has allowed him to be almost ever present in Premier League games. To clearly paint the picture, he has played at least 80% of the available minutes in all Premier League seasons since he joined Liverpool. <laughs> Insane! Salah is a true unicorn in Liverpool's team, a left-footed right winger with pace, strength, creativity and a goal-scoring instinct. No player comes to mind that can fit that bill. There will be no other Salah. However, Liverpool will have to find a way to do it, perhaps unearth another gem or do with available options. So, which players can take Mohamed Salah's place at Liverpool? 1. Kylian Mbappe When you lose your star player, the natural instinct is that you replace them with another. If it happens Liverpool lose Salah to Saudi Arabia, expect a huge offer. Al Ittihad reportedly contemplated bidding in excess of £150 million in the summer, meaning Liverpool will have a mega budget to play with, and they can target anyone anyone including the Frenchman, who is undoubtedly the game's ultimate perfect forward. The French striker will become a free agent next summer, meaning he could be affordable for Liverpool, who have maintained an interest for years now. With no transfer fee required, the money coming in from Salah's sale could go into his huge salary required and additional costs, such as agent and signing on fees. Of course, he is no out-and-out -out winger. He would want to play as a central striker, so Liverpool will still need a right winger, but is that so hard to do, given this is Mbappe we're talking about? They will find a way around it, right? The only challenge for Liverpool would be convincing Mbappe to ditch his long-held dream of making Santiago Bernabeu his home. Real Madrid have forever held an interest in the Frenchman and will no doubt be there in the summer to finally push for his signature. And if you ask around, everyone will tell you they believe he will be a Real Madrid player after next summer. Football can, however, spring surprises at times. Number 2. Bukayo Saka We talked about Mbappe not being position-specific for Liverpool, but Arsenal's Saka is perfectly fit the role. The England international, just like Salah, is a left-footed right winger who has grown into one of the Premier League's best attackers, and at just 22, he will only get better. He was the star player last season as the Gunners pushed Manchester City all the way scoring 14 goals and assisting a further 11. The most notable thing is the fact that his attacking and creative output has improved with every season since he first broke into the Arsenal team. Pricing Saka away from Arsenal will not be an easy thing though. The England international could command a fee similar to what Liverpool could get for Salah or even more, considering he just signed a four-year contract in May and age is also on his side. Also, Saka would not be keen on ditching his boyhood club, especially not now that the club is emerging from the shadows of its former self. Number 3. Kavisha Kvartskilia The Georgian star's reputation has gone through the roof in the last 12 months after leading Napoli to their first Serie A title in 33 years, scoring 12 goals and assisting 13 more. Blessed with dynamic speed, skillful quick feet and youthful exuberance, his stock has quickly risen and is now considered as a 100 million pound player. Liverpool can give a first-hand account of his force. He was instrumental as Napoli swept the Anfield club aside in a 4-1 in the Champions League group stage clash last season. One minor thing though, he has played the vast majority of his career as a left winger, the opposite side of Salah. 
His arrival could possibly see a change in the formation of Klopp's team, with Dominic Soboslai, who spent majority of his time at RB Leipzig on the right, moving out wide. All in all, he might not directly replace Sala, but he would be entertaining to have at Anfield if Liverpool decide to go for him. 4. Jared Bowen Salah has proved to be a high-volume attacker since joining Liverpool, averaging a minimum of three shots per game across his Premier League career with Liverpool so far. He has been effective with his driving runs from the right flank, and no Premier League player had more attacking carries than Salah's 58 last season. Playing within a far less possession-dominant side, Bowen is among the top 20 by this metric in the Premier League with 41 attacking carries. Whether it is dropping the shoulder to get a shot away or driving by the byline to create for others, Bowen has always had a similar desire to provide end product once he gets going. He has been linked with Liverpool in the past seasons and would definitely fare well in a team that dominates the ball more and looking to break low block defenses like Liverpool does. He is also adept with both feet and capable of scoring with his head. The England international is also no stranger to coupling his goals with assists registering over a combined 80 goals and assists in slightly over 150 appearances. Another advantage is that Bowen is homegrown and has two years left on his Hammers contract, meaning he could be available at a relatively affordable price. 5. Michael Olise Still in the Premier League, Crystal Palace's Olise is one other player that could be of interest to Liverpool. The youngster had the best season yet at the London club last time out, becoming their first player to record 10 or more assists in a single Premier League campaign. He might not possess the eye for goal that most elite wide forwards like Salah have, but his pace, close control, power and eye for a pass have caught the attention of some of the Premier League's big boys, including Chelsea and Manchester City, with the former bidding for his services in the summer. Him not possessing the goal-scoring ability would however mean Liverpool will need to change their attacking approach, so that the other forward players may need to take on more responsibility. Aston Villa's Musa Diabli, PSV Eindhoven's Johan Bakayoko, and Real Sociedad's Takafusa Kubo have also been mentioned as possible replacements. Yet, there could still be one more option for Liverpool, an in-house solution. In January 2018, Liverpool sold Philippe Coutinho for £142 million, and instead of buying a direct replacement, they went for Virgil van Dijk, a centre-back, and goalkeeper Allison for a combined fee of £135 million, and two years later, they had managed to reclaim their spot at the table of Europe's elite, winning both the Champions League and Premier League. Liverpool didn't address their defence this summer, which could become a key area for improvement come next summer, and in the event Salah leaves, they could use the money to address their defence, perhaps bring in young defenders who could be a part of a new rebuild that is currently taking place at Anfield. Also. The Reds have in recent transfer windows pumped up their forward line, bringing in Luis Diaz, Darwin Nunez and Cody Gokpo. Despite these signings though, there's no natural successor to Salah, and you get the feeling that Liverpool would still need to bring in an extra body. However, one other solution would be shifting Diaz to the right wing, which could prove a master stroke as they will still be able to maintain the deadly forward line that has terrorized the Premier League in recent years. Who do you think will perfectly fit Mohamed Salah's shoes when, if, the Egyptian leaves the club? Let us know in the comments below.